Yo, what's up, guys? Remy the Remy in the house, showcasing for you guys today the mighty the Armadillo mod in Sonic Lost World. So, yeah, these character mods are just coming out right now, and we are going to be showcasing them for you at rapid speed. I got another one on the way, we've got Knuckles Sonic coming out soon, so check that one out. And yeah, I'm still keeping an eye on the shadow mods and whatnot, but anyway, let's get into this. We're going to start off with Zone 1, like we always do. Cause your boy hasn't finished the game. <laughs> anyway, man, let's take a look at this, man. Look, this looks pretty dope, man. Of course, he's still got the blue streak and all, but I think they haven't figured out how to change the streak yet. Unless the classic Sonic mod had a different streak. But yeah, man, this is Mighty the Armadillo. Good. Fun fact, actually, Mighty the Armadillo was supposed to be Sonic. As in, when I say that, I mean, basically, he was going to be the mascot, like, they were considering, like, characters to be the mascot for Sega, like, to rival Mario, and it was between a hedgehog and an armadillo, and then eventually they were like, now we're gonna go with the hedgehog because it, it, it fits more or whatever. So, Mighty basically got axed to the side, basically, you know, he just, he just got tossed aside, they just forgot about this dude. Man with that frame, what was that, man, what was that? He got tossed to the side? And then what happened is they had some arcade game, they're like, you know what, let's bring Mighty back, you know. And they brought Mighty back for that arcade game along with Ray the Flying Squirrel, yep, some foreign characters, right. And then, um, what else? Then they brought him back for that Knuckles Chaotix, a spin-off game, but they haven't really given Mighty much love. Let's go this way. Not, not up the tree, I meant, I meant left, god. They haven't really given him much love, and then, okay, there we go, Animal. And then, yeah. That's it, they pretty much neglected Mighty. And then, probably because he looked very similar to Sonic, like they were considering him as the Sonic, so... When they picked Sonic, he was like, we can't have Mighty around because they're too similar. Obviously they got their differences and whatnot. But yeah, he was a Knuckles Chaotix with Team Chaotix, and then they made Sonic Heroes. And they had to get rid of, you know, one of them because it was teams of three, and they are probably like, well, Mighty's too similar to Sonic, so we'll just ditch him. And ever since then, it's never been the same. Whoa, okay, be careful. But yeah, man, that's pretty much what it is. He was actually in Sonic Generations, though. If you pay attention in City Escape, you know, if you're not boosting to win, you might actually see some posters. I don't know if it's more than one, but there was definitely a poster there that said that Mighty was basically missing. It was basically a joke to say that, yeah, we ditched Mighty, basically. All right, let's dive over here. All right, let's go. Bam. Nice. All right, go ahead and hit that checkpoint. I'm taking a different route because I keep you playing this stage for all these mods, so I might as well take a different route. You know what I mean? All right, come on, let's try and get this. Oh. Ah! Come on! I think it's so hard that muck speed section, man. God. Anyway, let's keep going. Let me get that whistle. Let's see what the whistle look like. It's mighty. I mean, it's pretty much the same, but. Come on, aim, aim, shoot it! All right, hit that spring. But man, this definitely looks like a nice mod. I'm gonna be using this mod for a while because I mean, I'm still waiting for that shadow. So, but anyway, we cleared Windy Hill Zone One. Look at Mighty Man, good though. He does really look similar to Sonic though, if you think about it. All right, so what we're gonna do? Is wait, grab that invincibility though. Damn, give me that. Give me that. I think you can access those things when you press R3. You can see everything here. I don't know why there's star is on them, but anyway, let's go to Windy Hill Zone 2. Normal play. All right, bam, nice. I'm really trying to get a hang of this, this game though. Okay, when you get near them, they drop their, their spikes. Bam. Get the ring! Alright. God. What? Now you can't talk now. Can't talk now. But your boy Mighty has just demolished your ass. Woo! That was skill. Okay. Wait for them to drop. Alright. Ah! That was too fast. Well, one of them still got their spikes, of course. Alright. Am I gonna am I gonna use the wisp or not? <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm probably not gonna use the wisp right now. I've already got that red ring anyway. 
Oh, nice. Okay, swerve that, swerve that. But yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Do you think they shouldn't have ditched Mighty? Do you think he should have stayed in? And what about those other comic book characters that we don't see? Me personally, if they were going to revive a dead character from the Sonic series, I would like to see Sally back. Like, from Sonic Sapphire, she was Sonic's girlfriend and she was dope. You know, like, she was, she was real dope, like... Better than Amy when it comes to Sonic girlfriends. Oh god, crucifixion in the comment section. <laughs> but yeah, I prefer Sally to Amy. But yeah, Amy's still dope. You know, she's actually much better in the Boom series instead of the the more you know overbearing chick that she was back in Sonic X or whatnot. But yeah, I'd definitely like to see them bring some old characters back. But we're still struggling to see them bring other characters that aren't like Sonic Tails and Knuckles. So. We're gonna have to wait for them to do that first, you know, before they're even gonna think of bringing back Mighty the Armadillo. But yeah. Anyway, we've completed Windy Hill Zone 2. Nice and easy, no deaths, because your boy is getting good at this game. I don't even need to use that asteroid. Look at it sleeping in the top right there, anyway. So yeah, that brings us to the end of this video. We showcased Mighty the Armadillo. You know, I played a couple stages with him, so yeah, well, that's that's pretty much it for this video. So make sure to like this video, leave a comment, let me know what you thought about the video, and if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Sonic games, Mario games, Nintendo games, you know the drill, man. And yeah, I've got another mod. I think it's the Knuckle Sonic mod I'm going to be showcasing later on. So make sure to stay tuned for that. And then I might even showcase the Sonic Generations mod, even even though I know people are on this Lost World thing. There's a Sonic Generations mod I really want to showcase. Let me know in the comment section below if you, if you still care about Generations mods, because I'm starting to get a bit paranoid right now, you know, because of the whole Lost World modding craze right now. But yeah, there's a Sonic Generations mod I want to showcase, so I'll showcase that as well as the Lost World mod that I've got to showcase. But yeah, I know the playthrough's been a bit late because, you know, I've been showing all these mods and whatnot, but it's going to come very soon. I'm probably going to record a bunch of parts for Lost World on Saturday and maybe some Adventure DX as well. So I'll be dropping those throughout Sunday and the next week. So make sure to stay tuned for that, but it's a wrap right now, so thanks you guys for watching, it's been real, Doremi out!